ring of fire. And the ring of fire.
then you come in and sing on there, and then you go. Then you go to the empty. Sing the C empty. Sing. God is watching me. Here we go.
all good singing tonight. Woo! When I go like this. Hey, little mama, now don't you cry. You go. <laughs> he knows everything that goes on.
I don't know what I'm going to do when I go to record. And I go to the studio and I go, oh my God, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? And then all of a sudden I get in the, in the studio with the guys and we stay there for about a week. And, and, and we just start, I start making things up. This, this comes. So when we're all done, we've done about 13 songs and everything. And, there, and every song I did, you know, a lot of guys when they record, they, they sign a re recording contract for about five years. So they have to do, they're going to record all the, the good stuff, you know, on all those albums. But what they don't do is, they don't put all the good stuff on those albums. They only put maybe one. Because they know they're going to record more albums. So why should they put all the good stuff on the album? It's ridiculous. So they put fillers, what we call fillers. Well, I don't do that. Every song I do, I do it as if it's, as it's my last that I'll ever do on the service. And when I'm done, I go, I'll never be, I'll never record again because I don't know what I'll ever record again. Because I can't remember what I did. So I have to take the CD home and I have to listen to it and learn it again. Because I can't remember to how to do it on the stage because it was all improv. So I see, like I told you, I'm not a guitar player, just a guitar player. Well, to me, I picked up an ukulele and learned how to sing and play the Tennessee Waltz. And, and, and I couldn't figure out why my fingers wouldn't go that way because the book didn't say, turn it the other way, stupid, you're left-handed. Because <laughs> drums was my first instrument and G. Cooper was my hero and he was the first guy to make drums a solo instrument in the band. So because I would drum with my left hand like that, I started strumming like that. So when Gene Cooper would go like this, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, that's what you would do on the drum. Jimmy, show him that. Ba, 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 like that. Okay, now, anyway, this was the witch. Here we go. I'm going to get a, a kind of a cute beginning.
Listen. 